What is a design? Designs protect the external appearance of a product, including the color, shape, or configuration. Why should I register my design? If customers love your product's outfit, design protection is for you. Registration will increase your reputation on the marketplace and allow you to prevent undue appropriation of your efforts by third parties while you safely exploit them. When should I register my design? Novelty is a common requirement in all Latin American countries. It is therefore advisable to register the design prior to commercializing it. Otherwise, your own disclosure may harm your design's novelty. However, thanks to the Paris Convention, design applicants enjoy a six-month priority period to file their design in all Latin American countries, while keeping its first application date as the priority date. Any design filed after the priority period may be rejected for lack of novelty. Furthermore, almost all Latin American countries provide a six-month grace period after the first disclosure of your design. But take care! Such disclosure might affect your applications in other territories where no grace period is granted. For example, in EU countries. Where should I register my design? Protect it in at least all those countries where you aim to operate at short and medium term. Bear in mind that design protection in Latin America varies from 5 to 25 years, depending on the country. However, please note that international registration through the Hague system is not possible in Latin America. You will therefore need to apply for a design on a country-by-country -country basis. How should I register my design? 1. Apply for registration. Be sure to take into account whether it is mandatory to appoint an attorney or not. Fees, deadlines, translations, and any other specific requirements which must be analyzed on a country-by-country -country basis. 2. Follow up the granting procedure. Depending on the country, the National Intellectual Property Office performs a mandatory substantive examination, as in Mexico, a mere formal one, like in Uruguay, or a voluntary substantive examination if the applicant requests it, like in Brazil. Moreover, it is strongly advisable to regularly monitor official bulletins to avoid missing deadlines. Whenever possible, fluent communication with the examiner may also allow you to overcome certain objections from third parties, who are generally entitled to oppose the registration. And finally, three. Do not forget to pay the renewal fees. Once your design has been granted, do not forget to renew it, usually every five years. So, if you are thinking of expanding your business to Latin America, do it well and contact the Latin America IPR SME Help Desk. We can provide you with the first-line intellectual property support and help you in taking the right decision. <laughs>